Hey guys, we are literally just back from the Riverland. We got home probably 10, 15 minutes ago. <laughs> How big is that? The trucks behind me don't want to stop. They're like creeping. Yeah, it's a lot of them getting started. That's massive. So we went up there to spend some time with Jazzy's family, which was great. And some of our old friends happened to be there at the same time, which was awesome. So we had a little bit of a quieter weekend. I think only 21, 22 sales, but we kind of expected that yeah. coming into Christmas last week. Uh, but we did get some cool items while away. So I'll put some overlays in just now of what we picked up when we're in the Riverland. We went to Barry, we hit up the salvos here, found a couple of nice items, a pair of Matic diesels and a nice Timberland shirt. Then back to Loxton and I found a whole set of Heartbeat. So the best find of the whole trip was definitely this whole lot of Heartbeat DVDs. Now I think there's 16 out of the 18 series here. I had to do a little bit of negotiation so I ended up getting them down to 150 because they were sort of asking like $18 per series and some even more. So it was like $3 per disc on everything. So I ended up getting them for 150 bucks. Now, if I get the other two, we should make 550 out of this. So very, very happy with that. I didn't get much footage in store because I was literally closing as we walked in. So I just wanted to get these and get out, but very happy with the Heartbeat DVD set. So I was absolutely stoked with the Heartbeat pickup. Haven't found that one ever before, paid up for it, but now we just need two of them to complete the set and we should get about 500, 550 once we complete the set. So very happy with that. But let's get into the picking. All right, we've only got the 24 orders going out the door so far. All right, first up we have Die Hard DVD set. I think this uh, solves a mystery if Die Hard is a Christmas movie or not because it sold a week before Christmas. So $21 that one sold for. Obviously it'll have to go track because it is thick. So we're probably gonna make 10 to $12 on that one after all the postage. How is that a Christmas movie? All right, three cassettes going out, a Technotronic Superbad and the Honey Drippers. So this one, they sent us a message and they said that they actually only want Superbad, only send that, not these, they're gonna put them in the rubbish. Would you just send them what they asked for or would you send them all because that's how it's listed? We have the drop shipping octopus buying a uh, genuine nest controller off us. So we hope he's happy with this one. I'm assuming he's going to put it in a set um, and sell it on. So it's very clean. It's tested. It's working. Hopefully he doesn't uh, <laughs> doesn't take us over because we, we're giving him good stock. It sold a nice Kagi, which is the predecessor to Kuji sweater. Now this is already sold once. Hey Jazz. Mm -hmm. They cancelled it after I had already packaged it. So I've just left it packaged. I know what's in there. A pair of the New Balance going out the door. This was from a uh, bulk lot we picked up, I don't know, about a month ago now. Uh, about nine bucks an item. So these sold for $44.95. I hate taking pictures of fluoro. All right, Dreiser Bone went out the door. We paid $30 for this oilskin jacket at Savers like, I don't know, two weeks ago. I'm not even sure we ended up making a video about that particular pickup, but 30 into 135, the 3XL. The bigger sizes do really well for us. We were thinking about trying to flip it on uh, Facebook, but it ended up selling on eBay pretty quickly, so. I mentioned it's got its little shoulder cape. Schmick. So we've got two Mega Drive games going out the door for 20 bucks, so pretty cheap. Those two there will go as a set, tracked, so we'll probably make 10 bucks on that. Got ourselves another Iron Wounds belt going out the door for $70, free postage. What a bargain! What an absolute bargain! We love ticking these over. I saw this Iron Wings black leather suede saddlebag for one seventy nine dollars. My favorite product ever. Three Star Wars movies sold for ninety nine ninety five. So these are four, five, and six. Your theatrical version. Uh, we were being a little bit cheeky with the price on these, but we have sold them before for similar. But we thought we'd probably get an offer about seventy. So I'm happy that they paid the full price. Pepper's got my leg. <laughs> All right, we actually picked up a whole bunch more of these Warhammer books for five bucks each. We've sold two or three for like a hundred already. This one sold for $24.95. Pretty happy with that little sale. And uh, Agatha was keeping it company. Hey, Agatha. Very cheap Game Boy Advance game going out the door for 15 bucks. We will be able to send this untracked because it is very thin. Uh, and it does have a manual with it. So 3.30 post. <laughs> Calm down. 3.30 post. Uh, and it costs us four bucks, so we're only going to make five, six dollars on that one. Me. Uh, chilling rain going out the door. This one's actually going out to Chris Furlong. So thank you very much for uh, purchasing that off the store. I think there might have been a little yeah. discount code going around. So I think Chris got a nice little price <laughs> on that one, but happy to get another one of these out the door. All right, a couple more little games going out here. These Sega Genesis games, NBA Action 94 and an NBA Jam for $32. So they would have cost us four bucks each and they'll go tracked as well. 
we've got a Panasonic DVD player VHS combo going out the door. A 280 plus 20 post. Um, apparently Pepper wants to go with the, uh, yeah. the player. But 300 bucks on those. I think that was from lot five. So happy to get another sale out the door. Got another hat going out the door. Houston Astros World Series Baseball going out for $49. Free post. Oh yeah. Nice pair of Pumas going out there for $49.95. Uh, we picked them up a while ago for $14, bucks, so not huge money on those, but happy to get that out the door and get some investment back. Rookie mistake, I didn't tie the laces together. Gotta to tie the laces. Got your collection vessel today? Got it. I've got to say, only like one weekend off, but I feel like I'm in holiday mode. First up was a bra, $17. Bucks. We picked up like hundreds of these, like couple years ago for like 50 cents. Do and you then... remember driving back and I couldn't use the rear vision mirror because that <laughs> was just bras. So 17 bucks on that, so that'll go shipped. So we'll probably make $8 after everything, <laughs> maybe $7 on that. So I know they tick over. I wouldn't pick them up again, but for the price we paid. But we did. <laughs> All right, we've actually got two Harley long sleeves going to the same buyers. So a red one and a gray one. We'll start with a red in LR5. I once sold for $47.95. I find that with the Harley, we either get really low ball offers or bundles of like two or three together. There's yeah. no in between. And then we have a grey one in LR2 for $46.03. So, bundle deal, it only cost us probably eight bucks to ship those. Yeah. So, very happy with that. <laughs> Love selling Pendleton. We sold this virgin wool jacket for 70 free postage, women's blazer. Always love finding those. And always check for holes. A nice little RM Williams embroidered long sleeve white cotton shirt, size 10, out the door for $42.95. We paid $3.30 per item in a bulk lot for this one, so some decent money on that. Of the pre owned variety. This is a really cool piece. This Brisbane Lions vintage Davenport, I guess like robe dressing gown type thing. Uh, $65 that one sold for. Oh. Originally we paid $7.20, so happy with that. Check out. Pattern. And we have an Iron Williams Rachel long sleeve shirt for $69.95. Uh, that looks like a Rachel right there. Here's one I prepared earlier. Thank you all so much for your support this year. If you've watched one video or all of them, we appreciate it so much. And we have one more video coming out this year and we are working ever so much closer to something really huge for us. Yeah, so make sure you check out that video that's gonna drop on Friday. We'll drop some little hints in there what we've been working towards. It's happening. Because we have made a giant leap towards it. So thank you very much. Leave us a comment below what your sales have been like this weekend and what your favorite sale was. Otherwise, we'll see you on Friday for the last video of 2021. Thanks for joining us, guys. Hey, guys, we literally just got back from the Riverlands, so we spent the weekend with Jazzy's Jazzy. Yeah.